and we're going to talk to you about uh, some fun science stuff today. Chris, do you remember science in elementary school, middle oh. school, high school? Very what fun was memories. your favorite experience? Favorite experience uh, got to be the egg drop experiment. Egg Absolutely. drop was always so much fun because it had an element of creativity, had to make the box. You brought an egg from home, you'd create a little container, try to protect it, and someone, usually the uh, custodian or someone, would throw it off of the roof and you'd watch it hit the ground and it was a lot of fun to see whose egg was gonna break and who wasn't. Right, it incorporates a little bit of egg violence. It, you've got lots of excitement with seeing splatters. Uh, it's a fun activity. What it always seemed to be missing to me was the data. Very true. So but what we did at RGSAT to try to fix that problem is we took our handy dandy accelerometer sensor and we put it in with some egg drop experiments. So we put together a whole bunch of boxes and then we put in the sensor and we tried different materials, marshmallows, popcorn, uh, parachute, and we read the data from each one to see which one scientifically was actually the best at keeping the egg safe. Let's check it out. That was really cool. So which of those drops was your favorite? Oh, it was easily the parachute. It had such interesting data where you saw when the parachute caught that there was a little spike of G-force and then as it hit, you could see it did not have, have a high spike as all of the other all the other materials. Yep. Now, my favorite part was just looking at the data, like actually digging in and, and making sense of, what, of all these numbers that we got. Uh, a lot of fun. Right. So if you want to see more experiments like this and do some of your own, go ahead and visit us at rdsat.com.